Hello everybody, this is a 2002 325i. I did the uh, CCV bypass according to all the guys on the internet, what they said to do. Some put a catch can in, some uh, hooked up a, a hose right to the back, there's a port in the back. I decided to go a different route. I did what most of them did. I did uh, take this cover off and I capped off the intake port. Right? There's a hose coming in from here, down here, and then one coming up. So I just cut the hose, I capped it, so now nothing's coming out of the intake. Alright, so the intake is sealed. And then what I did over here was I took the factory pipe over here, I sliced it, took this off. I use the elbow since it has an O-ring. Nothing beats a factory connection, that's for sure. And it looks uh, a little dopey when you put a big hose clamp in there, to be honest. So, got a nice little heater hose, uh, probably about seven eighths. Then over there, I found a, uh, a threaded fitting. I think it's three quarters to a bobbed fitting. So three quarters fits right in there. Three eighths uh, fuel line hose is what I used. I trim down that pipe that was there. This is the piece that you see here. I go under, around the air box, two over here, towards the front. You know what? I tapped it into that intake, that re rectangular uh, intake port there that gets the fresh air. I don't know if you can see it in there, but it gets the fresh air from in there into the air box. Okay, right there. You know what? Since it's venting, I'm gonna just allow it to come out there naturally, go through here, and then when the motor's running, it's just gonna suck it right through. It'll come in through the top, and I got the air cleaner to filter out the uh, the smoke, and then it'll go through MAF back and burn it. It saves me getting a uh, catch can. It saves me finding room to put a catch can. It saves me uh, time to drain the catch can. So I'm gonna try it this way. It runs good. I put it in, I'll try it out. You know, let me know what you guys think. Right now I'm just gonna run it just the way it is. And I'll see how it goes. I mean, I could probably put a long hose if I wanted to and just go under it. But listen, make it as short as possible. And go the same way. It looks pretty, look, it looks nice and neat, huh? None of those bulky clamps and blue hoses and all kind of fancy stuff in there. All right, can you see it? There you go. I'm gonna try it out. Let you know in a couple of weeks. Adios.